31 Days Novena for Married Women Theme Cultivating Marital Bliss Through Prayer How to Prepare for the Novena Novena Guidelines Number 1 Every day do 3 hour Father Prayer Number 2 Do another personal prayer from the heart Number 3 Pray 3 Glory Be Number 4 If your family has a monthly or annual prayer Make it part of the menu. Number five, you can listen to a pre-recorded track or sing one from your heart to keep you in the mood. Number six, read the Bible verse of the day and the prayer. Number seven, end with a prayer of thanksgiving from your heart. Note, every Friday in these 31 days will be a fasting Friday. Third, 10th, 17th, 24th and 1st July, you can decide the form of fasting that works for you. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. For thy is the kingdom, thy power, and the glory. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thy is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us, lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thy is the kingdom, the power, the glory, and forevermore. Amen. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Day 14 Praying for my husband to be a godly leader. Pray for your husband to be a godly leader at work, in church, in your family, and anywhere else in life you may be. Scripture reference 1 Peter chapter 5, verse 1 to 4. It says, So I exhort the elders among you, as a fellow elder and a witness of the sufferings of Christ, as well as a partaker in the glory that is going to be revealed. Shepherd the flock of God that is among you, exercising oversight, not under compulsion, but willingly, as God would have you, not for shameful gain, but eagerly, not domineering over those in your charge, but being examples to the flock. And when the chief shepherd appears, you will receive the unfading crown of glory. Through your spirit, may he dwell with me according to the wisdom and knowledge of God. Scripture reference, 1 Peter chapter 3, verse 7, Ephesians chapter 5, verse 25. In Jesus' name, I trust and believe that he will be the godly father you have called him to be.